Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are on episode 289 of the death walkthrough last time if you haven't checked it out already we got um we, we met the cabal people and did stuff and things and we're heading into the gumdrop forest today which is really cool so yeah let's just crack right in I guess and do that oh look they've got wisps here now that's fantastic we need to search for witches valued customer to the gumdrop forest home of caramel's lovely gumdrop trees the not so secret ingredient in nana's gummy lines native to our already sugary soil the trees are also treated with fairy dust ensuring the gummies made from their fruits stay sweet and helpful i will eat you Oh, the gummies aren't for eating. Mm. They're automated laborers, used all over caramel, and soon they'll be coming to a world near you. Hey, hey, don't you go there. Don't eat that. Don't go into that cave. Don't, I need help here. Oh, oh dear. Guess we are going to help because that's why we're here apparently, to help the world of caramel be happy, maybe, I don't know. Um, we can't get that chest from down there. I'm quite sad. I thought we could. But anyway, Gnome Ranger. hi oh customer! Sorry, valued customer. I should not ask you to help me. Scion of Bartleby, you say? I know not what that means, but I, I do need a hand, as per my earlier shouting. You see, there are gobblers on the loose! Normally, they do not leave the island of Gobblerton, because, you know, one cannot swim just after eating, and they are gobblers. But every now and then one eats a light lunch, comes over here and devours caramel as a buffet dinner. They are the walking natural disasters. And there are a great many in this cave. We need something to settle them down long enough to get them home. The ticket for that? Marshmallow stuff. This is a substance regularly dropped by the local marshmallows. Fight them for me and get that sweet stuff. Schnell und away! Um, right, we are defeating my favorite things in this game now, um, the Marshfellow. This is quite sad, and, you know, there's a badge to defeat a thousand of them, and I don't know if I can bring myself to doing that, because these guys are just so cute and adorable. I know some people disagree, but look at them! They are so cute, I love them so much, I really do, and I feel really bad that I have to destroy them individually. Hopefully only three of them, four of them maybe, but, but we'll see. I'll be back in just a bit. Right! I am back. We have killed these guys. Only four. I'm only killing the bare minimum for now. Um, one day I'll come on a murderous rampage and destroy their whole population. But not today, because I like them too much. But hopefully we get it from this last fight here. Maybe. Possibly. Usually the drop rates are pretty good, from what I remember. Yeah, they are. Fantastic. So yeah, it's kind of basically 100%, which is good. Very, very good. Right, let's go and talk to the Gnome Ranger again. Um, but those guys aren't too bad. Um, they are fire. They do a we couple of weird spells, so just be careful. Just be careful, but they're not too bad. Wunderbar, valued customer. The next step should be easy. All we need to do is go into the cave and tempt the gobblers with the chewy stuff before their hunger blinds them to the difference between people and bags of meat. Hmm, this sounds like a job for the Skion of Bitter Tree. Yeah, that is exactly what I said. Now, hiyo, Sion, and away! The Skion of Bitter Tree. That's us. We are the Skion of Bitter Tree. Did you not know that? Because I bet you didn't. Um, how many things do we have? We have, um, five. Wow, we're, we're so professional. We need 75 of them, but we've got five already. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Imagine that. It's a dialogue. Mm, I smell marshmallows and meat. So hungry. I just want to gobble it all up. Um, so yeah, this isn't a boss fight. So um, I will be back in just a bit once we have defeated these guys. They don't look too bad. From memory, they don't cheat. So yeah, I'll be back in just a bit. Right, I am back. Hopefully this kills. Um, we will see. Otherwise, we have a ship of fools just to pass us through. But I think we've done it think we did it it would be only the death guy that i was worried about um but it seems like he's dead so that's good that is fantastic these poor wee gobblers didn't really stand a chance at all unfortunately but hey makes it easier for us easy jobs for the sky on of bitter tree Ooh, marshmallow stuff that's my favorite food adjacent substance uh-huh no go just eat got it mm, gimme 
Okie dokie. Now we need to explore deeper. That that sounds fun. Fighting makes me hungry. Hunger makes me angry. Anger makes me fight. Okie dokie. Again, these guys are fire and storm. That's exciting. Different schools. Uh, but yeah, I'll be back in just a bit. Right. We're hitting. I don't know if this is going to kill. We did only have one blade, so we will see. It may, it may not. Um, we will crit. How much damage we do it depends on how much their blockers i guess um and it looks like we did kill so that's good five 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 seven nearly a satisfying number nearly close but not quite mm, marshmallow hi oh that marshmallow stuff takes forever to chew even for gobblers should give me enough time to take them to gobleton i would bring you with me but gobleton is not zoned for valued customers might i ask where are you going Ah, Sweetsburg! It is just through the forest, down the path. Good luck to you. Have an old fashioned delightful day. Um, so I did a really bad thing. And um I forgot to record the the boss fight. I you know you know, I just we got to the boss. He was he wasn't very hard. Hangry Scobbler. And um, you know, I thought I hit record, but apparently I didn't. Um <laughs> and I only just noticed now. But we're off to Sweetsburg now. Um, you didn't miss much. It was just the boss fight and that dialogue I just replayed. Um, and yeah, Sweetsburg is just over here and we're going to the Gumi plant. I can't believe I did that. I am such a noob. Such a noob. It's been so long since I've recorded the death walkthrough. That's why it's just, you know, taken everything out of me. I just don't know how to do this whole death walkthrough thing anymore. It's been so long. So long. But hey, we, we're, we're trying. We're trying. Wouldn't be my videos without some form of mistake. Um, right, the gummy plant. Sour gummies are not funny. Sour gummies are not funny. So what do we say, you big silly dummies? Were you sent by Nana? We spit it, Nana. Pity. Why would we be happy to make treats and sing and dance all day? Especially when the gummy bears and worms and things we were making went cuckoo. So we run outside and refuse to work. Except for the ones who did not. Trapped in the plants, yeah? Pinned in by the sour gummies. Someone needs to help them. Um, sounds like we're going to be helping them, I guess. Who knows? Who knows? Into the gummy factory. Oh, hello. Oh, look, a helpful person. Quickly, valued customer. My wunderbar gummical wonderniers are trapped by the gummies. Help! We are trapped by the gummies! You see, I need someone to fight the gummies so they can escape. Do you know someone who could do that? Yeah, I I think I saw them one time, possibly. Um, but right, we're gonna do this on on camera just just so I can explain that boss fight that we did just previously because I accidentally forgot to record because I'm an absolute idiot. Um, but yeah, basically the hangry scobbler he wasn't too bad. He was myth. He had like nine thousand health. Um, we didn't get any plates, this is so sad. And, um, yeah, he stunned me once with Medusa, so, so that was cool. Um, but yeah, otherwise, it wasn't too difficult. He doesn't even cheat, so, you know, it was just a normal boss fight. Um, <laughs> I'm so mad that I screwed that up, though. I'm so mad. I am so mad. Right, I need one blade, please. Thank you. I'll take it. I'll take this blade. Then we can hit and hopefully kill. Maybe. We will find out. If not, we'll just ship a fools. Because that is my game strategy these days. <laughs> One blade, and if I don't kill, well, we'll just ship a fools in it. We'll kill. Because these guys have, like, no health. No health at all. It's ridiculous. It's fantastic, but also ridiculous at the same time. What is this? What is this? Don't you dare stun me. Thank you. I get really worried about myth. They stun so much. So much in caramel. It's ridiculous. Like, every single myth thing knows a stun of some form. It's crazy. Don't you dare join me, firemans. Yeah, that's right. You keep running. You keep running. Yeah. Asserting that dominance there. Nice. Well, there we go. Nice work. There's one down. And look, there's two down. Fantastic. GG. We did it. We did it, chat. Amazing. Good job. Look, my wunderbar gumakul wundernias flee to the safety. Get over here quickly. Okay. I just wanted to move before we got pulled into combat. Danke, customer, but according to all my various switches and gauges, we have another problem. There is an error in the fizzle pebble generator, where we put the fizzle pebbles and the soda water to create the boom and power the plant. 
It is usually maintained by the gummy bears, but if they have gone sour, they could be disrupting the flow of pebbles. If the pebble volume gets too low, soda will flood the system and shut down the plant too high and we all explode. Please go to the power room, stop the gummies and stabilize the generator. Eric is on to me. He's on to me. He knows who I am. I must run. I must hide. Ah! I must get away from here. Um, right. Let's go to... I don't even know who he is. The sun's so bad. But shout out to Eric. What a man. He's on his fire, which I don't have added. I'm sure if he was on a character that I had added, I would know exactly who it was. Um, nice. Um, I don't know if you can hear me from here. But yeah, right. Let's go into the power room and see what is up. What is a foot in the power room? I don't know. We will find out, though. Will we find out? Who knows? It's a gummy bear. They look so cute, yet their dialogue is so intimidating. I don't like it. But anyway, um, we're going to go through these gummy bear rooms, and I'll be back in just a bit. Right, I am back. Hopefully this first fight is now completed. Um, they earthquaked me, and I lost all of my blades. It is a sad day. Um, don't feel sorry for me though, because these gummies, they're, they're just too sour and I had to take them out with a Lulu instead of a Scarecrow. It's, it, it's sad, but it had to happen. I apologize. Right, next fight. Oh no, not even dialogue. Wow, that's exciting. That's exciting. Okay, these guys are doubly angry. They had two girls. They're, they're pretty angry. Right, I'll be back once I've defeated these guys then. Right, I am back. We defeated those little gummies, and now we're up to the U bear, which is for Uber. Um, <laughs> get a Uber bear, but it's a U bear. <laughs> Fun. It, it's pretty Uber. Um, I keep forgetting to take out the feints. That I need to take out the feints. Whoopsie daisy. Oh well. Let's just do this we got a shed right off the bat which is fantastic absolutely amazing um yeah these, these gummies are not too bad the ice ones are they're kind of annoying because they do shield a lot um obviously they're the basically the same as the ones that we've already fought previously in the what second episode um so what last episode was that yeah last episode i think um i don't know it's just all blending together at this point um but yeah these guys shield quite a lot so just be wary of that the myth ones they do earthquake so again just be wary um yeah they also have healing current as well and it's like why why, why does myth have healing current i don't know but they do it's weird um these guys also can stun with um th this spell called frost giant i assume it still stuns i have no clue I'm assuming so. Correct. Right. Probably. Maybe. Yes, it does. Okie dokie then. Okie dokie. It's actually kind of annoying that they changed all of the spells because I just really don't know what they do at the moment. Like, I have no clue what the new spells do. Um, or like any of the spells in the game, basically, other than the ones that I commonly use all the time, like Scarecrow, for instance. And it kind of annoys me because I don't know what's going to happen. Like... I, don't, I can't remember how many blades Leviathan takes off anymore, if it's still two or if it's like one. And I, I think, I think Sirens now just gives the weakness, uh, not the weakness, the mantle, but I'm not 100% sure. And it, it kind of annoys me because I just don't know what's going to happen anymore. And it's kind of like relearning the game all over again, which is the one thing that I dislike about the spell change because I just don't know. I just really don't know what's going to happen. Um, this is a stun as well, I believe. Yeah, it is. Um, luckily we had a stun block. Please don't stun me again. Please really just don't do that. That would be so rude of you. So rude. Luckily he passed. That's good. Uber passed. Which is fantastic. Right, let's see if this can kill through his shield. Yikes. It's like a 45 shield or something. 40, 45, something like that. Right? 30. Okay. That's good with my PS. That's pretty good. Not gonna lie. That's pretty good. Um, right, and this should probably kill. Yeah, I think that killed. I think that killed. If not, it didn't. He's on, like, 5 health or something. 18 health, yeah. 5 health or something. Man, that sucks. That sucks. That sucks so much. Oh, don't shield again. Rude. 
So rude. How dare you do this? How dare you? Do you not know, sir? I am trying to defeat you. Not be stalled for five million years. Ugh. Yeah. Right. Please win. Ple please do enough. I'm, I'm sure it can do 18. Yeah, it did more than 18. 1, 2, 3, 6. It would be so good if it was 1, 2, 3, 4. That would have been fantastic. Absolutely tremendous. Valued customer, hello. Have you reached the Fizzle Pebble generator? Wunderbar. Just hit the various buttons and switches to stabilize the soda flow. But whatever you do, do not hit the levers and knickknacks, or the whole plant will explode. Now, schnell. Okie dokie. Let's do the fizzle generator. We get so much XP Mind from these dungeons. My are happy with it. Uh, valued customer. The generator is stable. I am going to make with the fleeing before the gummies get me. Come find me outside the plant. And have an old-fashioned delightful day. Right, let's head to the foreman. We don't have a mark out there, so we're just going to run. Where is that? It goes to Caramel City. That's a wee way away. So we're not going to use that one. We could use the innovator, but eh. Eh. It doesn't really need to be used. So, yeah, this is these factories look so cool. It's reused a lot. You're going to see this same factory like a million times. Um, but it looks cool, and I like it a lot. I really do. Oh, it takes us right outside. That's fantastic. Many, many donkers again. If only we knew what was making the gummies turn sour. What? Nana thinks it is us? Why? Ah, witches, they sneak into towns at night and whisper curses to the people. One of mine employees fell victim to them. He came into work with not a whistle on his lips nor a song in his heart. He actually said, I ah, get this, Nana's happiness initiative makes him sad. <gasps> That's witch talk. Nobody is sad in Caramel. And if unhappiness is the witch's goal, it would make sense they were behind the sour gummies. But I do not know where to find them. Ask around town, valued customer. Perhaps someone here knows. And have an old-fashioned delightful day. Right. The witching scour. <laughs> Nearly the witching hour. Um, yeah, by the way, there's an innovator right here. Ooh, parchment. Yummy. Yummy, yummy. There's an innovator right here, which can take you back to Caramel. Um, obviously, this is the first one that we encounter. So that's pretty cool. There's also a goodwill ambassador here who has side quests. I don't know what the side quests are. I'll be doing them on... Um, uh, on stream on twitch and it'll be uploaded to my second channel so you should totally uh, subscribe no there are no witches no witches with honey words about the misery silly wizard and your notion of witches sounds suspicious there very very suspicious i don't like him at all he's lying to me why do you want to know about the witches who sent you the witches warned us about people like you Hmm. Hmm. I really want to get one level today. Please, please, can we just get one level? Hello, valued customer. Witches in Sweetsburg? Oh my. But that would explain the poor attitude in town. The witches cursed words. Everybody is always happy in Sweetsburg. The company actually gives us bonuses for smiling and whistling <laughs> while we work. But now those evil witches come in and spread like miasma, draining this joy out of people, leaving only the, what is the word? Sadness. Come to think of it, since the incident in the gummy plant, there's been a lot of cackling coming from Nana's ice cream parlor. Check there. Right, I want a level, so we're doing this. I wasn't intending to do this, but we're, we're going to do it. We're just going to go and get a level. This might be a slightly longer episode, but hey, I missed a boss fight. How could I do that? You know, we, we got to have at least one semi-boss fight. I think this is not a boss fight, but two elite fights surely makes up for that, right? 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 No, no, that is not it. You need sugar, spice, and anything nice. Just pick a nice thing. Sister, the recipe clearly states everything nice. We need to go shopping. That is obviously a misprint. How could you literally put all the nice things in all the universe into this pot? It makes no sense. The sisters, <laughs> it seems we have a visitor, a customer. An agent of the company come to rout the witches. Let us show them how wrong they are. <laughs> 
that laugh is very loud and giggly and i don't like it really don't like it also this is one of the magic rooms where just as soon as you start the battle everything disappears somehow i don't know where it goes i would love to know exactly where it goes um but that's just something we're not gonna find out right these three witches um just slight spoilers will play a very important part um in the story coming up later so um yeah i didn't actually note really take that into consideration or remember that when i was in test run but for those of you who are wondering yes these are the same things the same witches that you may see later just saying just saying right burning rampage interesting hey at least we have two rounds um but yeah one is fire and then storm and then life so yeah Tabitha, Samantha, and what is your name? I can't even remember the other one's name. It's Tabitha, Samantha, Tabitha, and Endora. That's right. Endora is weird though. We don't we don't talk about Endora. No one talks about Endora. You know, we should talk more about Endora. Who is Endora? You know, who is she? What does she want? I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? But their casting animation is so cool. I love it. I really, really, really love it. It's fantastic. Also, their natural attack with their wee little broom. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Um, right. Please just pass. Nope, of course not. You are hitting. Oh, of course. Of course you are hitting. Nope, you're just trapping. That's fine. She's going for one in a million or something. Jeez. Too bad she be dead. Huh? Huh? Sorry, Samantha. Sorry, Samantha, but you might die here. Hey, look. The <laughs> burning rampage hasn't even ticked yet. Because it's two rounds. It's ridiculously long now really really long right crit yeah like i said crit is so boring now because it just it just always happens it's quite sad quite sad really right there we go gg these guys are not too difficult we're gonna do like eight thousand on this life oh no not quite that boost is absolutely non-existent i swear Jeez. right unless she has more block you can fight a witch wizard, but you cannot stop our words. No, 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 no. They seep into every mind across Caramel. They will sink into your mind as well. You will see. Nana will fall. Once all that is sweet turns sour, and all that is happy turns glum. And you all will beg the witches to save you. Okie dokie. Um, interesting interesting wee little dialogue there but those are the witches Woo, we will learn more about them later oh hello so a giant hole opened in the ground and just whomp, swallowed your boss yes sir a great yawn and cavity it was words cannot do it justice but and if you don't give me what i want I reckon it'll happen again uh-oh Blizzard, come to finish what you started at the estate, have you? Well, I got only one thing to say to that. <coughs> oh, that weren't it. What I was meaning to say, what I want you to truly understand before I send you to the great coop in the sky is... Look over there! He ran away, I would say, like the decapitated chicken, but he still had his head. So, just like the big chicken he is, then. He went to the literary cafe, Les Bon Bon Mots. Be careful if you follow him. He recruited some of my witch cursed Wundaneers as enforcers. Right. We got a level. That, that's all I wanted to do today. 132. Nice. Not too bad. Next episode, we will be, um,. Seeing what happened to Mr. Quake Charmer over in Les Bon Bon, um, which is just over here. Just over here. Um, yeah, but otherwise, thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, press the wee little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember to craft outside the box.